Hey everybody, happy Sunday. It is week 61 and um, I have not been on the last couple weeks. It's been a rough couple weeks. Um, I'm actually going to do week 60's topic right now and then I'm going to, directly following this, upload week 61's topic. So I'm choosing to do this because week 60 I think was a really important topic um, and actually hits probably pretty close to home for me right now. Um, which is sweetheart self-care. What do I do to take care of myself? And I say this hits close to home for me right now because I don't feel like I have been taking care of myself. Um, I feel like over the last year and a half or so, um, a big part of my focus has been Taryn's transition. Um, and here Taryn is changing and self-caring and I don't feel like I've done that um, and that's my fault um, I, I, I have neglected myself so going forward I'm going to be having more self-care um, and that's what I'm going to be talking about right now um, part of my self-care is in a sense doing these videos you know this is something I do yes it revolves around Taryn and his transition um, but it also revolves around me what I need to do for myself um, in this whole process and um, you know it's something individualized for me but still connected to him and what he's going through um, so it really still keeps me in touch <clears throat> so that's one thing um, I think I'm also going to be starting to take some yoga classes. Um, I found a local group here in Sacramento that does a, what they call an all bodies class. Since I'm kind of a big girl, um, I am a little self-conscious about going to a typical yoga studio with all of them. Sorry anybody, skinny bitches. Um, and it's just not something I feel personally comfortable doing. So therefore, um, I found one that I think I will feel comfortable doing. And it's also very um, trans friendly, gender friendly, um, gender queer, just very community oriented. Um, so actually, the couple people that I know um, from the trans community actually go to this group. So I'm kind of really excited about that. Um, I'm also just going to start eating a lot healthier, um, which is something I've been needing to do and I've kind of been on and off, but I'm really going to try to dedicate myself to that um, and, and see, you know, it's time for me to take care of myself. My mom passed away at a really early age um, due to weight issues, or it didn't help, but um, it's not something I want for myself, so therefore it's something I'm going to start working on. Um, I know some of the other girls that said like massages and stuff like that. Um, I'm totally down for that. Um, so hopefully I can get some of that in too. Um, I also really enjoy um, like pedicures and like foot massages. Um, so probably start doing that again. I kind of have slacked off on some of that stuff um, just because money's been a little tight. But um, if I can save up here and there and you know spend an easy $20 on helping me relax, it's well worth it. So, um, I, I think um, I'm a perfect example of kind of getting lost, and not lost, I don't want to say I was lost, wrapped up in um, my relationship completely and um, Taryn's transition and kind of need to take a step back and figure out what I need for myself and definitely some individualism and um, doing things for me that take care of me and separate myself um, from just completely being wrapped up in this in this transition and everything that there goes along with it um, and remember that I'm also a person and an individual separate from our relationship um, and if I can't make myself better I can't make our relationship better so I think I'm gonna kinda stick with that theory and motto for right now that before I can make our relationship better I have to make myself better um, so self-care is very very important and it's something I'm going to be doing a lot more of in the very near future 
So I'm going to end on that. So everybody have a great evening, and um, I will see you very, very soon because I'm going to be uploading one more video very shortly. All right, bye.